the first week of July, and this is when all the corn is ready to harvest. All the ears are nice and plump. And I'll kind of peel one back to get a good look at the maturity. This variety of corn is called jackpot. How I cook it is I roll it up, piece of wax paper, put it in the microwave, this is a basting brush with macadamia nut oil. And then I coat it with a little bit of salt. Mm. It's time to harvest the first cucumbers. This variety is called Alibi. I've had the best luck growing this particular strain of cucumber. And these plants are loaded down. You can see there's cucumbers one after another. It's July 1st. Now that the lettuce and the peas are done, I will move these containers into the crawl space. And this works out good because now that the summertime heat is here, I'll have less to water up on the deck. Getting the first cayenne hot peppers. Having a little bit of an issue with this aroma tomato plant. There's some yellowing leaves. Kind of just looking a little sickly. I add a cayenne hot pepper, and what really kicks it off is this bunching green onion and I'll come out here, pick
pick a fresh leaf of basil. Add a little bit of water. Add some salt, some pepper, half a tablespoon of avocado oil, and I like to sprinkle a little bit of freshly chopped basil. And this is probably my favorite thing from the garden. Thick and hearty tomato soup. <laughs> Gonna harvest the Emerald Towers basil. I like to wash the plants while they're still alive. It gets the dirt off the bottom of the leaves. If you try to wash the leaves after you trim everything, it bruises it. So this does the least damage. This variety is called Emerald Towers. Definitely recommend this basil. It's the best one I've grown so far. I leave a little bit of growth and this will bush back out and produce a whole new harvest. I bring them inside and these will dry out in about a week. <laughs> 